Nedge here. Move! Move! <laughs> I am ready to speak of my dream. Of course, Deliverer. But first, you must help me. How? I have visions of danger. A dark cloud looms over three heads. An adventurer, a philanderer, and a beggar are all at risk. What would I do for them? Give each an amulet to guard against the darkness. One may be found near the great temple. One in its eastern district. And one in the tunnels that wind below it. I'll wait for you by the docks at the basin of the great temple. out there. Do you 
know the seer. He sent help! Thank the gods! Ready for a fight, Magi? Always. That is done. A freedom! You are quite the fighter. I do my best. They caught me off guard the first time. The seer offers this amulet to keep you from further harm. My children cannot eat a stone. I cannot do more for you than this. May your luck change course. Pardon my rudeness. You have already risked yourself to save me. As long as I am alive, my family still has a chance. Greatest of masters of craftsmen, forgive me. I was sure it was he who had brought down the curse upon Memphis. These are the tunnels the seer mentioned. I'm on the right track.
Hey, wait! Save this one. Divine ones, circle around here. May this amulet preserve his calm.
Set aside your pride. I have nothing to reward you with, except my thanks. I will claim my reward elsewhere. The seer sends this amulet. His visions show you are in need of protection. Why would I need this piece of junk? Just take it so we can conclude our business. Fine. I suppose wearing it will make my mother happy. That is all three amulets given out. Now to return to the seer. My way. Move! Move! Yeah, yeah! Clear the way! The armor ah. is the Oh! That's bad. Shit. Hey, shit. Stop him! Hey, get out of the way! Stop! May the greatest of masters of craftsmen forgive me. I was sure it was he who had brought down the curse upon Memphis. Have you delivered the amulets? Yes. One arrived too late to protect its bearer. Which? The adventurer. He met a lonely end bitten by a snake. This is sad news. All the same, I consider your debt paid. A sacred island lies farther in the embrace of Mother Nile. Bring me there, and I will tear aside the curtain that shrouds your nightmares. Oh, deliverer. Tell me what you saw. I saw... I saw what has lain behind my eyes every night for the past year. It begins with a sandstorm. I rise to my feet and walk a corridor of ruins passing into the Hall of Judgment. There, a twin of myself, places a black stone heart into the scales of my heart. It is then that the god snake strikes.
Delivera, would you be free of the curse that plagues your sleep? There is a ritual that will banish it from your mind forever. Yes. Do it then. Go beneath the waters south of here and bring up the statue of Gnome from the sunken temple of Ramses. With this likeness of the great Potter to hand, the ritual can be performed. Here is the statue. Hnum, sculptor of children. He will battle Apep in your place. This ritual needs your mind's strength. Sit by my side and meditate as I speak with the gods. Rise! O light, ascend! O light! You who are without, come in! Oh! Did he leave the island? I told you that there is a reward to handle a group of bandits. Would you be interested? Hurry, 
Never cease to impress my ex.
Site here. I should be cautious around here. You want with me? Ha!
Swift. Oh. Thief! Thief! Medjai! Catch that little good for nothing! between us. How did a smart boy like you get tricked into working for bandits? I don't work for them. This mean old lady locked up a bunch of us kids. She makes us steal for her. Locked up? Yeah. My sister was going to save us. And she said to meet her in the shipyard by the river. But she never came. Will you look for her? I'll steal you an apple. <laughs> hey, you don't need to buy my help. It is yours for free. What is your sister's name? Kawit. And mine's Ifri. If you find Kawit, tell her I'm mad at her. Who's here, Anache? Yeren! Who's in it? Hemset, her, oh yes. Gehes! What? Mikeni? Sejerie? Oh, beautiful. And best. Oh. That ship will not sail anytime soon. There's the mast from the band ship. Colorful sail. Unusual. An oil cellar. They kept the children caged. An oil cellar. You may have seen Kawit. You break, keep your distance, or I'll break your face. Easy now. Did you see a young girl around the shipyard yesterday? I see lots of girls. Most not worth looking at twice. They would likely say the same of you. If it is information you want, you have just tripled its price. I'd rather throw my coin pouch in the river. A 
There must be another way to make him talk. The ship was dry docked when it caught fire. Traces of oil. Hmm. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! Must have been a blaze to make Ra jealous. Yes. They say the ship caught fire in the harbor last night. Know how it happened? No. I am just here to repair it. Position, get Back off, I tell you. I despise thieves and loiterers. Just do not break anything else. Get away from here before you break something. By the limbs of Osiris, you are a cruel man. What happened with the girl? I looked at her twice. The second time, she was stealing my biggest jar of oil. She vanished like a demon in daylight. When I came back, the ruffians were destroying my stock. Made a lot of you sink to the bottom of the Nile. I think I understand what happened here. Gawith stole an oil jar from that oaf of a merchant, then hid until nightfall. Under cover of darkness, she spread oil on the ship and set it aflame. The blaze spread to the whole vessel. While the ship burned, Gawith freed the children held on the docks, but the bandits must have caught her. Whoever owns this ship was responsible for the kidnappings. Sail. I need to talk to that child. Mm, the guards here are vigilant. Your brother sent me here. Where is Kawit? They took her and everyone else to a house in the city. Some rich lady named Gaia owns it. It's by the temple of Hathor. Will you save my family? By the mother goddess, I will.
So what do you miss most about your family? Mother's Game on you! God carry this key. Why would the God carry this key? He must unlock something important. Live forever. Did Nessem knew? No, young Ifri did. Where is he? What do you mean? I followed you the whole way. Take Matt to your home. Go. Why don't you go with them? I'm going to track down that Roman bitch who did this to my family. If you want to help me kill her, meet me at the house of Neff. Uh... in front of the little ones. What happened here? <laughs> Who was he? Neff. The children called him father. This is his house. This is his house! You are injured. I don't give a shit. The Roman hag who did this leaves by boat for Alexandria today. Help me feed her to the crocodiles one piece at a time. I can go alone. No need for you to bloody yourself, father. It has to be me! Is your need worth leaving the children unprotected? Destroy her name, Bayek of Siwa. I need to move quickly, or this monster will flee Memphis. <laughs> Senu can find a ship with colored sails faster than I can.
about what he did. Time to die! not to draw attention here. a vengeance now. I hope it quiets her heart.
This area is off limits. Harriet, look at Yahoo!
Gestapo, do you think I'll have many children? <laughs> hey, I hope you give your mother and I many grandchildren. I'll have to find a wife then. You are young, my son. There's no reason to rush. I won't rush. But what if I already know? You need to learn how to be a Magi first. Oh, Tawaret.
Watch hey. out! Hold on!
seen in this area.
Can I tempt you with something? Goodbye. We need to clean this place up and get it running again. Our Fayum, our home, is now a place where there are Greek-only stalls. These naked Yadit will not even serve Egyptians. Greeks grow fatter and richer in Egypt, while we go hungry. The poor are taxed more than the rich. Why is this happening? This is our home. Egypt belongs to us. Prosperity for all? There is no grain. They have burned our farms and... get our food. We know what Greek prosperity means. Prosperity for all, they say. Well, where, is where are the benefits, the peace of mind? It is all with the Greeks. It is not. In Egypt, while we go hungry, the poor are taxed more than the rich. Why is this happening? This is our home. Egypt belongs Be quick. to us. They are selling fast, unique and Don't valuable worry. treasures. I won't Siwa. let them close down this kitchen. Henut? Yes. Hotefre sent me. I am here to help. And I have your daughter's doll. Great. I was awaiting word from my man. Thank you. Come. Eat and we can talk. Oh, I love my new doll, Bayek. I will name her Iset, and she will be the protector of all Fayum. Ever since Hotefles got a hold of that ledger, Fayum has been on edge. Soldiers with torches patrolled every night, and this aunt's kitchen was practically razed to the ground. They have left Shadia and me alone at least. Hotefles has made sure of that. Where is the ledger now? I instructed our most loyal servant to hide it in our villa. They can search the place as many times as they want. They will never find it. Can you take me there? I have been summoned to the lighthouse for another of their routine investigations. Uh, that may not be safe. 
The Ptolemaic authorities seem to be working with the crocodile. It happens every few days. Don't worry. They wouldn't dare touch someone in an official position. Shadia, show Bayek the way to our home. Come on, Uncle Bayek! You can see my house from that roof! Follow me! You are not afraid of heights, are you? Hey, lead on, little one. I will follow. Where did you learn to climb like that? That looks like fun. <laughs> I come up here a lot. Everything looks so beautiful. The people should be happy, but they are not. Don't worry. Your mother and father will look after them. Where is your house? On the hill there. See it? Yes. And soldiers. Thank you, Shadia. You should go back to your mother now. It might get dangerous. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. Isak can fight, you know. She will protect me. La la la. Not to draw attention here. Did we find the legend? Not yet, but it won't be long. The captain is upstairs questioning the servant. Stupid Egyptian. This is a marked woman. Complaints to Alexandria about the administration's practices in Fayum, from Genut. She didn't have much success. No ledger. Where is it? They said it would be here! Servants tried to barricade the doors. They weren't quick enough. Gods. Shadia wrote this. She has the ledger. And I sent her back to her mother. I have to find Henut before the soldiers get to her. Oh, Shadia. What have you done, little one? You cannot play games with the crocodile.
Sede tu shem eni tuer, nit itchu. Our home is now a place where there are Greek-only stalls. These naked Iadit will not even serve Egyptians. Have you seen Hanut? Is she here? The soldiers just came and took her to the lighthouse. Young Shadja too. Hanut argued with them, but they would not listen. Something is wrong, isn't it? This has never happened before. Get word to Hotefres. Hurry! Damn all this! Hanut and Shadja are at the lighthouse. I need to get there now! Neck! Neck! Genuine treasure! While we go hungry! From the poor are taxed more than the rich! Why is this happening? This evil boy has profaned the gods. His punishment will be an Sheep won't survive an encounter with me. Hey! I must be careful now. Something is close. I swear it. Wait a second. There is no escape. You will pay, corpse.
It is over. The crocodile has won. The ledger lost. My daughter. My Shadia. He has taken everything from us. He will pay for this. And all those who serve him. None of that will bring Shadia back. No. But at least you'll have the comfort of revenge. We both will. I hope so. I will do anything I can to help you, brother. Has he not been able to tell you anything? Only that there were other men with the soldiers. Large, imposing warriors. One red-haired. Bandits? Soldiers? I believe they were gladiators. From the arena in Crocodilopolis. It seems this... This monster uses fighters to do his bidding. I will find this monster, friend. He will die.
Whoa.
Ugh! <sighs> 
Greetings, friend. Happy Bye for you, the best. Game on you. Huh? Idioti. Oran vuli mi di mi canaste ina. The gladiatorial arena. So the crocodile recruits from this place for his personal army. I need to find out more about it. Excuse me. What can you tell me about this place? Can't you see? It's an arena for Roman blood sport. Barbaric, if you ask me. But it's found favor with those desperate to forget their troubles. It used to be a temple. It should have been left that way. Hey, Neb. What can you tell me about the men who fight here? Men? These are not men, they're gods. You've never seen such savage warriors. They could break you in half with one strike. Ah. Do any of them have red hair? Gods among gods, have you never heard of the brothers from Gaul? Can't you feel their eyes on you? Their statues are beside me. The Ovikos. The living embodiment of war. His fists are deadlier than any weapon. Sir! Are you the owner here? Yes, I am the owner. Felix Martialis. Who are you? Another rough knuckle no name seeking fame? I only want entry to the arena. I heard you have got a fighter worth watching. With red hair? Ah, you mean the Gallic brothers. You heard right. But let me save you some time, camel boy. You cannot afford it. Now piss off before you scare away someone who can. Sir, this man wears a Magi badge. Mehmed what? Ah, I do not even care. Can you fight? You look the part, like a vicious, mangy dog. <laughs> nah, nah. I have already got an Egyptian. A huntress from Siwa, who's worth three of you. She frequents the obelisk in the East End if you want an impromptu beating. It is the only way inside this arena. Fight in the streets and the gladiator can bring you in. So, the Gallic brothers are involved in Shadia's murder. But why are they doing the crocodile's bidding? I need to get inside and learn more. The arena owner mentioned a C1 gladiator to the east at an obelisk. I wonder if I know her. Siwa is a small place. I should go and see. Is not just a handful of. 
was a good place to to prosper hmm? <laughs> but I never expected to find you here kids <laughs> what can I say I heard the call of the arena <laughs> can you believe it I am a gladiator now huh? <laughs> but come come let us talk and drink <laughs> I'm telling you, Bayek, I am so close to my dream. If only I was given the chance, I know I could become champion. I mean wealth, luxury, fame. What more could a woman want? Huh? That's why I came to Fayum, to make a new life for myself and bury the past. But I was turned away from the arena doors. <laughs> so you have finally given up trying to put the world to rights. Good. Such things are impossible. Felix is slow to trust outsiders. But do not worry. With my backing, we'll soon be fighting side by side. First, we drink. And in the morning, we can go to the arena for the proper introductions. Eh, it's good to have you here, old friend. I want this man to be my partner. As it happens, the Iberian was torn apart by lions yesterday. 
I may have an opening. And if Kemsa vouches for you... You will need a title if you're going to team up, though. How about the Siwan Warriors? I think the Guardians of Siwa would be more fitting. Is that memorable enough for you? I have heard worse. Come inside. No pharaoh or god in the arena to protect you, Magi. <laughs> this is where you will probably die. Try to do it with drama, it pleases the crowd. On the off chance you live, you will be rewarded with glory and fame. And another chance to die. Such is the short but luminous life of a gladiator. All right, who do we have? Ah, there is Callistos. Galistos, a former soldier of Ptolemy who claimed to know how to handle his sword. Horus, he was my best fighter once, but age ruins us all. He's not much more than a bedpan now. He trains the novices. Is that armor from Ptolemy's army? Most of the fighters cannot afford their own armor. In any case, it is soon ruined. The army does not miss a few suits here and there, and it adds to the authenticity. Speaking of authenticity, in the arena, you use the weapons I give you. There are no exceptions. You already know Kensa, whose glowing but suspect recommendation brought you here. Bayek! Crocodilopolis welcomes another champion! Or another bag of blood and shit. I want to see if he can fight. And who better to test him than the one who recommended him? <laughs> what do you say? Ready to draw a sword, old Magi? <laughs> Let's see if you have improved. I promise. Not bad, old man! <laughs> How is that for all? Nick! You need more style you. and flash! <laughs> But you have got a pleasing, vicious streak for a sand dog. Okay, Kensa. You've got a new partner. We open the door soon. Be ready. These are the scraps that Felix wants to throw our way? <laughs> they make a poor meal, my brother. <laughs> I'm going to slice off your balls and feed them to you. Our main obstacle to glory, the Gallic brothers. I know who they are. We are ready. <laughs> are you? <laughs> Everyone thinks they are ready till they get a fist in the face. I am starting you against a few novices. If you survive, we will talk about more. Two warriors against the odds. The crowds love unfair fights. Do not disappoint them. Or me. Are they screaming for our blood, or for theirs? Any blood will do. No such thing as innocent here. Do not stay your blade, brother. They certainly will not. Every man here knows the risks. You have taken to this new life easily. When you see the look 
on their faces. Oh, they adore me by it. The men, the women, I have everything I can want. <laughs> These two sand bandits are tougher than they look. Let us make sure they notice us. Stubbers was one of my best ideas. The crowd loves you. I told you we were destined for greatness, Felix. <laughs> greatness? Ho oh, ho ho! Easy, easy, damsel dust mite. You have a long way to go. It is a good start, but you are not contenders. You do not get to the Gallic brothers by beating a few shit stained novices. Though, to be honest, I hope you make it. I am weary of you nagging me. What do we need to do to face them? Gods and peace, not you two! Just concentrate on the next round. For annoying me, I am adding lions this time. They have not eaten for days. You are their dinner. Find me when you are ready. If what Kensa says is true, any of the gladiators could be working for the crocodile. There might be evidence here of the jobs the Gallic brothers did. Maybe even the identity of their patron. Correspondence between Felix and someone who is not named about contracting gladiators. An impressive first outing, C1. I'm a little jealous. I need a faster way to make coin. I've had fighters are offered work outside the arena. You're quick to learn secrets, my friend. We're not supposed to talk about it. But opportunities come along from time to time. I think I might have just proven myself worthy. Do you know who the contracts come from? There is a reason these people operate in shadow. No one knows their identity. Take my advice. If you're lucky enough to be chosen, do what you are asked to, and be thankful for the money. So, you are feeling good, planning your ride to the top. Trust me, what we do, it's not noble. We are mercenaries, that's all. Mercenaries? Swords for hire by the wealthy. Y yes, so you heard. My advice, refuse the offers. It's a slippery dune. I have seen good men die. Just fight and go home. Don't do the contracts. We are on our way, old friend. After all this time, I might finally get my shot at the Gallic Brothers. And it's thanks to you. 
Eh, hey, I would like nothing more. What about these other contracts you mentioned earlier? Oh, the righteous Bayek is willing to dirty his hands. Times have changed, Seni. I suppose it is hard to be a Magi all the time. You will have to ask Felix about those. Quietly. The best way to reach the crocodile is to beat the Gallic brothers. As if I needed more reason to slit the throats of Shadia's killers. Felix. I've heard some gladiators are chosen for... extra work. You heard wrong. And if there was an arrangement, you would have much more to do to earn your way in. Your job, you upstart dog noble, is to fight. That is it. You earn your gold in a pit, or you do not earn it. Then that is what I will do. We are ready. Finally. They are asking about you too at the arena in Sari. Put on a good show and we all profit. Lions. <laughs> Only when Felix can get them. They are much more expensive than men volunteering for a beat. There seems little honor in killing animals. Kill or be eaten by it. This it's caged. We will be fine. As long as we don't free it. Where is Kemsa? Her talents were required elsewhere today. You are going to have to win this one alone. You will be fine. Another errand for the unknown patron. Fighters who ask too many questions do not survive. It is a dangerous job. Accidents happen. I am only keen to prove myself. Then win this match. You will get your chance against the brothers. Beat them, and you will be noticed. Kenzo, okay? Holy Anubis. I have to win this. You cannot escape, you bastard! Bless you, my face. You will kill me soon! Going to 
cut you, bastard! Are you watching, Crocodilopolis? Is this the rise of a new challenger? Will the Gallic brothers keep their cows? Sorry I left you to fight alone, but I hear you did me proud. Felix sent you out on a job. Who was it for? I'll tell you everything in good time, brother. Just know that our future has never looked brighter. You have done well for a country, Conrad. Your time has come. The crowd is bored with Viridovics and the Ovikos destroying opponents with ease. I am counting on you to make this entertain. One more thing. Do not kill anyone. I want my top four fighters alive for rematches. I have given the Gauls the same order. All right, we will not kill them. But no promises about pain and humiliation. <laughs> this is it, Bayek, our big moment. They will build monuments and scroll our names across temples after this. We will be adored, rich, and champions. Here are the contenders to the crowd. The guardians of Siwa! Undefeated! Unmatched! It's the Gallic Brothers! <laughs> Yeah. 
Order! The Gallic brothers are defeated! You killed the child called Shadia! That is the least you deserve! The lighthouse! We didn't kill the lighthouse! We have done many terrible things, Siwan! But the murder of the child is not one of them! All hail the new champions! We were the guardians through. of Siwa! Capture the girl and take her to Berenike! To, to the crocodile! It was she who drowned the child, took a book from her, ordered a stone tied to her ankles, and pushed her in the water. There was nothing we could do! This is the real reason you came to me, isn't it? To uncover this patron, this crocodile! Bayek, why didn't you confide in me? Huh? I would have helped you! You're a mercenary, just now, like them! I couldn't take the chance! What fate awaits the fallen? No. Will it be life? Bayek! Or death? You know me better than... Death! Bayek, you have to know! So it was Berenike. She is the crocodile. She is the one who killed Sharia. She is the one who has brought ruin to so many. She calls herself the sponsor of Fayum's prosperity and culture. And her influence is felt throughout the region. Her wealth comes from her estate north of the city, Kerkesucha Granary, the largest in all of Egypt. She has arranged a symposium with others of influence in Fayum. Every night, she retires to her villa, where she courts their favor with bribes and silvered words. Then that is where I will find her. Thank you for everything, my friend. What will you do now? I will retire to our family villa. I need a drink. Henut and I must mourn in peace. Farewell, Bayek. Once you have done what you must, we would be glad to see you again. Out of my 
way! There's the granary, Hotefres Bokov. The crocodile must be inside. Hurry! How many weeks have they been shouting at the gate? Still nothing changes. I nothing barely have done. enough left. I should be cautious around here. Most of my grain is taken by taxes and soldiers. I barely have enough left to eat. Is this shit what they mean by prosperity? And what about Raho? His family lost their farm to Greek friends of the Nomark. Now they are forced to work like slaves on the land they once owned. Neck! Prosperity for all? Bah! It is prosperity only for the rich damn Greeks. And
Shadia! Murdered by one of you. Shadia. Who? Shadia! She was the child you drowned! Like all of your kind, you fail to see what greatness lies in store for Egypt. Is that what you tell yourself? You do not remember those you killed. She was the child of Henut and Hotefres. Henut was a stubborn rock. That ledger would have meant the end to all our hopes. You destroyed families. <laughs> I did what had to be done. I will destroy everything you stand for, Berenike! And I will destroy all others like you! But for now, all that matters is that you killed Shadia! And the last word you will remember is her name! Shadia! I wonder how Hotefrez and Henut are. I should visit them. Picked up that blade I found. Good. How's it going? Bad. Them or me. Listening to this, you work for Abstergo, and I'm dead. Do me a favor and make sure Sophia Rickin hears it. My dream was to work on the Animus Project. I waited 12 years. Waiting got me nowhere. So I built an Animus that lets me access anyone's memories, even ancestors not my own. I even witnessed the origins of the Assassins. Artifacts, tombs that were supposed to be stuff of legends, I found them. By killing me, you've lost all this knowledge. I understand why you thought I had to die. But did you have to kill my best friend? Why did she? Oh, Habibti. 
I should have listened to you. should visit them. I have killed all these naked Yadet. Apollodorus must be told. To Heraklion. <laughs> 